currently in Apuvu, um, topless town. I won't film too much because, yeah, <laughs> um, the native Ovahimba people, they naturally apply blood and ground dust um, on their bodies and walk around topless. So uh, we spent two days on a farm near Kamanyap. Uh, that's where I did the horse riding and the traditional longbow shooting. Um, our next stop is Ruakana, which is on the Angola border. After that, we're going to Oshakati. The two days has been a break from our trip, <laughs> not driving the whole time, uh, which felt kind of weird. But yeah, it was a good time. Angola. Kana Falls and it's super dry so no waterfall really and it's so hot <laughs> um, but from here we're driving to Oshikati we're gonna sleep there tonight and yeah no hippos sadly in the river but I believe more to Katima Manihu and Rindu we will definitely see some more wildlife enjoy the trip Oshakati, African
Good morning, we slept well. That side is Angola, this side is Namibia. The river is right in between, you just can't see it now. And yeah, today we're driving to Kutima Malilu area. We're camping nearby there tonight and tomorrow night. My cousin and her husband, they run a lodge up there. We've been warned the road can be full of obstacles, <laughs> which consists of elephants and lions so we'll see how much of those we'll see during daytime and yeah, I'm not, not exactly sure which side we're sleeping tonight which, which side of the river like Zambezi river or Kuvangu river but we are sure to find out and I'm looking forward to today, to today. <laughs> it's, this is part of the trip that I've been looking forward to the most so it's finally arrived and I'm enjoying it so much that's where the falls are actually they are not falls they're just rapids okay ah. it's not like Victoria falls just rapids like ah. We are currently at Pupa Falls. Um, it is Botswana border, close to the Botswana border. And from here we're going to Katima Mali. Oh, and don't judge, my glasses fell and they broke. So they are askew, I know, but I can't fix them every 10 seconds. So, <laughs> ah, it's just part of the trip. Oh well. <laughs> Uh, nothing much to see here. We have to pay for a boat ride to see the actual falls. So we're just going to drive on and see what we get along the way. We are at the campsite. We just arrived. Um, this is near Gongola, a small town. And the campsite is Mukolo, something like that. Uh, so in a minute we're just going to set up camp and then we'll see what we're doing from there. My cousin, she works at a lodge nearby. Family of us, they work at a lodge nearby so that's why we're here to visit them. Unfortunately, they don't have an opening for tonight and tomorrow night. So we're just staying nearby and yeah, we'll see them sometime today or tomorrow. Yes.
amazing. They got off of a boat and they dropped off, dropped us off at this lodge, and it's absolutely breathtaking. I don't even know what to take photos of, and it's been a special blessing to be here at sunset. And our boat is waiting almost, and we're almost going back by river to our campsite. We saw two hippos and a baby crocodile on the road, probably like half a meter long, <laughs> probably like half a meter crocodile. Yeah, it was something special. It was quite an experience. Mm -hmm.